In this problem, we have to simplify this expression. So we have to take the fourth root. And so whenever we do that, the goal is to basically write each of these pieces to the fourth power the best we possibly can. So obviously the Q cannot be written to the fourth power, so we leave that alone. But the other terms, you know, we, we do our best. So let's go ahead and do that. So solution. So this is the fourth root of all of that stuff. Let's start with the 32. So 32 is um, 2 to the fifth. So 2 to the fifth is equal to 32. So we can uh, break up a 32 as 2 to the 4 times 2 to the 1. And the reason is uh, that you actually add the exponents here. 4 plus 1 uh, is equal to 5. So we can write it um, this way. So it'll be 2 to the 4 times 2 to the 1. So that takes care of the 32. P to the 8th, we can write that in a clever way as uh, P squared to the 4th power. And that's because 4 times 2 is 8. Um, so if you multiply these, you do get back uh, the 8. The Q kind of hangs out. You can't really do anything with that. And R to the 5th is not so tough. We can write it as R to the 4 times R to the 1. Okay, that's again because we add the exponents when we multiply things with the same base. So 4 plus 1 is equal to 5. So recap, whenever you have a 4, the goal is to write everything to the 4th power. If you have like a 7, then the goal is to write everything to the 7th power. Now you might not always get it on the first try, but you just keep doing it and doing it and doing it until you can't do it anymore, and that's when you're done. So now we'll just go ahead and take the 4th root of everything that's here. It's a little bit ridiculous, but let's do it. And I, and I say that because a lot of people skip steps. Uh, I like to show like all the little all the little steps on these. these. These are actually pretty tough. So p squared to the fourth. And then the next one is the fourth root of q. And then the fourth root of r to the fourth. And the fourth root of r. And again, you can skip steps. You know, all the things with fours are going to go away. Like, like this will cancel. So boom. So we get just two, fourth root of two. And then, boom, p squared, fourth root of q, r, fourth root of r, right? Because the, the fourth root gets rid of the four. And let's see here. We're left with, let's put everything that doesn't have a root out front, okay? So everything that doesn't have a root, we'll put it out front. So it'll be 2 p squared r. And then everything that's left is in the fourth root. So we can put it back together. So we'll have the fourth root of 2qr. Boom, and there it is. This is definitely one of the harder uh, problems. I hope this video has been helpful. Good luck.